This is HPN Hampton Primary News. Welcome to the HPN Helicopter News, where today's learners and tomorrow's leaders are letting their dreams take flight. This is Claire and Brady with the weekly news for November 2nd, 2017. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may be seated. Something special is happening this weekend. Here is John with a report on what to expect. John, what can you tell us? Daylight saving time will stop. This weekend, we will move our clocks back one hour on Saturday night. We will have more light in the early morning, but it will get dark sooner in the afternoon. So don't forget, we fall back one hour in the fall. Stay, stay curious, Hampton Helicopters. Now back to Claire and Brady. Bye. Thank you, John. In breaking news, the first quarter of the school year ends today. That's right. Kyler is with a special guest to tell us more. Take it away, Kyler. Good morning, everyone, and good morning, Dr. Copter. What do you have to share with us today? Good morning, Hampton Scholars. I am here to tell you What's happening at Hampton? That's my job. Well, what is happening? A lot is happening. The first quarter of school is over, and the Hampton neighborhoods are busy presenting their research projects now. Kyler will help me demonstrate. Right, Kyler? Right. The pre-K students have been studying trees, all kinds of trees. Lots of learning, lots of new knowledge. Nice job, pre-K. Moving on to kindergarten, Kyler. The kindergarten students are creating a fabulous model of our town, Fort Bragg. They, they are building the neighborhoods, the hospital, the commissary, even our school is there. I heard they will make a book about it to go in our library. And Kyler, aren't you in first grade? I know you have been investigating the plants and animals of Fort Bragg. Where has your research taken you? We have been using 21st century skills to become scientists. We are studying the I mean the living things in our local habitat. And like the kindergartners, the first graders are making books. We're writing and illustrating books about the animals on Fort Bragg. Wonderful! The library will be thrilled to have these new books. 
Congratulations to all our Hampton students on a successful first quarter. Keep up the good work, scholars. Anything else, Dr. Copter? There's always something else. Reading. We are in a new month, so that means new home reading logs for November. Be sure to read at home every night Hampton Helicopters. That is how you become an excellent reader and a future leader. Also, you get a free pizza. Pizza! Mm -hmm. I love pizza. Who is that? Oh, that's my friend Happy. He sure mm -hmm. likes pizza. He does, and he loves reading. Speaking of reading, are you going to the bingo for books today, Kyler? I sure am. Don't forget, scholars, it is this afternoon at 4 o'clock, right here at Hampton. Well, thank you, Dr. Copter, for bringing us this valuable information. You're welcome, Kyler. Now I need to get back to work finding out What's happening at Hampton? That's my job. Goodbye, Dr. Copter. Now back to Claire and Brady. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. Thank you, Kyler and Dr. Copter. Have you heard the story about CNH? Yes. When they are together, they like to ride the train down the track and go. <laughs> Tomorrow is teacher work day. That means there will be no school for kids. We will be back in class on Monday. Well, that's all for the HPN helicopter news where to we will see you next Thursday same place same time have a good long weekend and remember let your dreams take flight bye, bye.